Um, I do want to take a moment. Uh, I know we'll have an assembly, of course, at the beginning of next week, but uh, I want to do some student recognition just because it's pretty timely. And in fact, I'm going to ask a couple students to come forward for this. Um, so I'd like Ben Simon and Prudvi Gudapati to, to come forward here for a moment. So, so this was a surprise for me. <laughs> Maybe I gotta check my mail. <laughs> That's it. That's it. So, uh, back in October, we recognized Ben and Prudby because they had been recognized as uh, National Merit semifinalists, which is um, uh, a, a distinction that's given to fewer than 20,000 students in the world based on how they perform on PSAT exams as juniors. Uh, now, once you become a semi-finalist, of course, there's another step. You could potentially become a finalist, but it's not as easy as taking just one test, although you still had to take another test. They had to take the SAT to prove that their PSAT was not a fluke. They also had to write essays, they had to call it, uh, teacher recommendations, and fill out some applications. And just in the past couple days, check your mail, they have been notified that they both have risen to the level of National Merit finalists. So congratulations. <laughs> so you can understand the historical context of this. Again, uh, one, originally for to be a semifinalist, you're against the pool of every other junior slash senior in the nation. Uh, but once you become a finalist, that, that was you being measured against that top pool already. And again, not just on test scores, but on other things that are a little more holistic. Um, the other piece to recognize, Mr. Uh, Hanford and I were speaking earlier today. We, of course, have had finalists in the past, most recently being Amelia Deering. We can't recall the last time the school had two finalists in the same year. So it's, it's very impressive and indicative, I think, of our whole entire senior class uh, that this level of learning is happening here. So uh, we will give you formal certificates at the award ceremonies the nights prior to graduation. But beyond that, congratulations.